my gosh, oh my gosh. Holy dooly. Welcome back to the Skids Factory. Today we're at Pajero Mountain Park. I'm a bit outnumbered by patrols. Uh, there's Dylan, Jackson, and our mate Kai. You may remember these two. Kai's also had a bit of cameo on the show before. Our mate Sam is halfway up Camp Road. We're parked here in front of Camp Road. He's up there with the GoPro, and he's going to be our spotter. And I am very scared because Kai just said before that I'm going to go home with smashed windows and damaged seals. So and maybe me as well. <laughs> Not feeling too confident. Uh, we Sam's patrol is out of action today. We on the way out, he actually blew a power steering hose, and we we did a dodgy fix, and it and it worked. But now it's just blown before we started filming. So he's the permanent spotter and also cameraman today. Uh, so I've aired down, and I'm going to give Camp Road a go, and let's. Yeah, see how many windows I can smash. Kai's like, ooh, I'm a film for behind. <laughs> Just waiting for it. All right, Kai, you on the camera? Oh, can you someone spot me on the on the start here? I don't know yeah, what's going hey, on. Jackson. Okay, I'm not going to lie. I'm actually really scared right now. Got Jackson in front. He's on the GoPro and also doing a bit of a spot. Do I go to the left of that or right of that? I'd try to ride over it. Over the top? Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Might just wait a second here. What do you reckon, Sam? Go to the right of this or the left? It's still flat, Sam says. Cooking my clutch, eh? I mean high. Yeah, but low takes um, stability control off. That wall's so close. Ooh. 
Am I looking over there, Wendy? <laughs> I can smell lots of clutch. Yeah, I'm now. Beeping at me. I made it! I made it! I don't know what's beeping at me. <laughs> the car doesn't like me. Okay, it's leveled out now. How was that? Camp Road in a pretty much well stocked Pajero. Well, not really. It's got a two inch lift. Frothing, absolutely frothing. Smashed it. <laughs> yeah. No lock is needed, eh? No, hell no. What's going on? And then when you get up here, I'll the exact opposite on that side. <laughs> <laughs> the Full chest peaking. <laughs> Look at him. Full drive fever. Righto, I'm unlocked at the moment because that's the way Woody decrees it, even though he's got traction control. Super touchy and low range. Lock is engaged. This guy does camp road, has to celebrate by grabbing a lemon squash. <laughs> Need to get my sugars up. <laughs> so you yeah, straddle, ride the see wall that there. line, the big line carved in? Yeah. You straddle that. I'm more confident in my tiles straddling that, not the upper bit. If I straddle that and come down the little left bit, see it, see It's all right, I'll spot you, bro, I'll spot you. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> You want that spot, mate? Are you good?
skewing about your car, Sammy. Got up there the easiest. Yeah. I've got the wireless version, <laughs> just Bluetooth to the top. <laughs> I wish I had a Bluetooth power steering hose, to be honest. How, how are we going to fix that later on? I don't know, that's tonight's <laughs> little brainstorm, I think. Uh, what, are you, what, are you, what are you thinking of? Kai's got some of that um, stripey electrical tape that electricians use. <laughs> just slab that on real hard. Here comes a big rig. Stendo 3000 cut. Turn the opposite way. Was there oil leaking before? Yeah. There was oil leaking before? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just I'm just messing no, <laughs> Just patrol things, Alan. Well. Just multicoloured patrol things. Multicoloured limousine patrols. Bro, you're supposed to do that at the bottom of the hill. Hey, can you take me to grad seeing as I just things a limousine? Huh? Can you take me to my graduation? In two-wheel drive. Spare axles, that mate. Sucks. First hill. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, I'm impressed though. Come on. You can swing a paint can pretty well, but Jesus, this was impressive. <laughs> I reckon the hub that's bugger. I reckon your canopy's bugger as well, bro. Hey, you know, two wheel drive limousine I've seen go up down. You know how your car's uh, not working. What about stealing an axle? Out of it? Yeah, bro. I know. You Barely put good. a dent in it. <laughs> First round of damage. Do you want to get the Nico out and right here, Camp Road, two wheel drive? What about the snap hub? No, nah, that was. Did I do that? Well, it looks pretty fresh to me. <laughs> uh, it's already like that anyway. No, I wasn't. Alright, where to next? You're the, uh, the tour guide. Go Telecom. Telecom Hill? Yep. Alright, sweet Let's go there. Alright, before we bail out, this is our mate Jared in his 76. He's going to give it a tackle, so. Just going to film him running up. Easy. They got factory lockers. Easy as, mate. I have to say, out of all the cars, you made it up easiest, mate. Oh, no, I don't know about that. The, the Pajero, mate. I reckon. Yeah, I reckon the Pajero. I reckon it takes the cake. 
I, I give something a little love tap there. I don't know if you saw that. A little scrub bar, yeah. Was it a scrub bar, yeah. What's right. the difference between me and you? They were about sixty thousand dollars. Um, a lot of money, a couple of cup holders, <laughs> and less friends. <laughs> Broke something. Oh, hey, there's no nuts on there, dude. Yeah, that's that. I just snapped it. That just, that's just to leave it at turn. Oh, you reckon that that's come on? But it doesn't work. It's just not. The other side's tight, and this one's not. So. What I have is the shocking. Yeah. Hey, I've got a tool kit if you want it. All the people you get up. To is mine still going? Right? Yes. Oh no. All right. Talk, I mate. see. Come on. <laughs> you, you stitch me up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got some um, Allen keys in here. Thank you. Just an FYI, Kai's been here three times in his life. And this, is his, it. this is no. his fourth time. Uh, that's misinformation. Okay. Rob, Rob he's been here three times. He's been here four times and he's rolled it three times out of those. Is times. that true? <laughs> is that true? No comment. <laughs> <laughs> okay, telecom him. So, yeah? like, no I'm very surprised with the Pajero, that's just blown me away. I was a bit really scared when that wall came up so close to the side there, but I'm um, pretty stoked with how it performed. And I got a bit confused about four high and four low. I thought four, I thought four low disengaged um, traction control, but it doesn't. It obviously works because I got up there. So, Have you done that, sir? Yeah. Oh yeah, this is pretty gnarly. You've been up here before, eh? Yeah. Is it? Easy or what's the go? What happens yeah, further far up? Far left. No, it's pretty easy further up, but um, just one of those like real slow crawl. First gear low. It's hard oh. with a manual, but the auto boys. <laughs> yeah, they have plenty of traction. What do you reckon, Kai? Two wheel drive, mate. Better than Hilux. <laughs> oh, <come on>. <laughs> <laughs> there is another way up that's long and steep, sort of more fun. I'm, I'll, I'll give it a go, but I'm just scared. Like so steep, that's all. Oh, the worst you can have is you roll over and die. <laughs> no diggy. <laughs> yeah, no diggy. Hey Sam, you're my eyes mate because I'm got a bit of poop coming out already. Those bash plates so bro. You don't want to do that, it's too fast. Well you gotta slow it down. Well I got no traction. Traction control just turned off. Yeah. Did your car ever beep and then traction turn off? I never did. Dumb shit like this, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Understand this is pretty steep here. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Wait, where's the anglometer? Maybe try a rock under that back wheel or something. Stay there and then go straight forward. Yeah, I Turn you over to the right more. 
That's yeah. one way to break his CV, I know that. Handbrake or something. Don't want to go back in the hole. Someone tell me what the beeping noise is on a Mitsubishi, because that's really annoying. Hang on, I just need to like catch my breath for a little bit. <laughs> Telecom Hill. I think we're about halfway up here. the top here. Nice work, Dylan. Nice work, mate. Yeah, good. So the show's not really over. You now got to come down a gnarly hill, which. Okay, 
Uh, which way am I going, Alan? It's like to the right and then left, or left and right? What's the go here? And then left, yeah. Just, you just got to veer over to the other track. Otherwise, there's a big gully thing. Holy sh! Are you in low? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Dude. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Holy dooly. <laughs> Dude, I think I got like three feet of there that time. So that is Camp Road and um, what's this one called again? Gnarly, phone reception hill finished. Really stoked with the Pajero. Stoked on those boost bash plates because without them, I would have definitely smashed off my transfer case or something. Actually, Al said that the fuel tank was, I was hung up on the fuel tank. So, um, lucky for that. I don't know where we're heading off to next. Sam's kind of the tour guide today because he's been here before and knows the tracks. Kai's been here before too, but his car is now two wheel drive. So, we'll have to just wait and see where we're going. But I'm, I'm keen for some more technical stuff for sure. I'm really stoked with the Pajero, how it's going. What up, camera? Dude, I was coming down that hill. I thought I was going to look like... So did I. Yeah, but you're going to look like a gnarly patrol, dude. God, you've got ABS. Yeah, true that. <laughs> you got one in the air heat, or...? What up? <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> Now go right hand down into that bank. Oh, I just back it out. What happened, Mr. Drifter? I can't make it, mate. Need lockers. Thousand years high car pressure. I'm gonna fan in my pocket. What's that? It's a Hulk Run on, bro. Hulk bro. Hulk prawn. It's a tire from Thailand, isn't it? It's gonna catch you a mad three meter here, mate. Oh, man, easy. We hit a couple of tracks already and had a bit of fun, but um, now we're gonna do. Uh, a rig rundown on the patrol with Sam from Built Not Bought. It's kind of like a, uh, I don't know, it's, like, it's kind of like a, uh, a a vehicle test, I suppose, but with a certain amount of, yeah, it's got certain things that you've got to be able to achieve. So flex, acceleration, comfort, economy, which instant failure, I'll tell you straight up. So um, you can check that out on Sam's channel. It'll be up there sooner or later. Is that the deer? That's a donkey, eh? So we finished up with Sam. Uh, grabbed myself a lemon squasher back at camp. These legends cooked us up some mean snags. Thanks, boys. Alan's done for the day, so he's setting up his marquee. I want to go back out for sure. You can run ride shotgun in the Pajero, Alan. Hey, mate, Timmy arrived. What's up, Timmy? Timmy's got a... We'll get the extra zoom on. A... Expensive Nissan Navara. Jackie Navara. Um, Kai's fixed his car too. So he, Kai pulled apart his hub. That's all done. Oh, check it out. <laughs> um, and Sam's in the process of trying to suss out to fix his car too. So. Don't offer to get around. No, it's just. Yeah. Might use it. Super stoked with how the Pajero has gone, and frothing that I had bash plates because. The fuel tank copped it. There's a big ding in the fuel tank. And Jackson said the car was actually hanging off the fuel tank. Like the whole car was sitting on it, so. i uh, just going to have a quick little hydration session. 
go back out in the tracks. Kai's going to take out the Extendo 5000 and we'll grab some firewood and then we'll come back and cook some steaks and veg and set up the drifter and we'll be good to go. Right. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I got the lock! Mother <laughs> You're going to give me cancer. What do you reckon about some of these here, dudes? Hell no. <laughs> go to the left. Yeah, I'll go to the left and go up there. See how good your traction control is. I can't see anything, so... That traction control shit works real good, eh? Watch the P's and Q's, Alan. That's yeah. We're on. Oh, this is even worse over this side. <laughs> I've got his four drive working again. Not sure if semi trailer or extended tab control. You must be down there and then maybe you go to the right. Sandy. <laughs> He's pretty Steve. <laughs> this is Steve, hey. What do you reckon, spotter? Booze bash plates. Watch out for that big root. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even see that there, eh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there's much more else you can do. Except I'll, for start packing. Can I use the winch because I want to? Yeah, it's not a bad time to use it. A successful winch job if I might say so myself. I think I did all right until everyone's going to tell me that I've done it wrong. Ridiculously, uh, there's a bit of a difference there. <laughs> <laughs> what misses all the like all the ruts, yeah, <laughs> just stretches over them.
So apparently we're not even at the red part of the track, says Sam. Navigator in the back seat. Red for patrols or red for Pajeros? <laughs> that looks like... Should I go right or should I go left? Full work bottom out. No, like up to the right there is what I meant. Track was easy as, I don't know about the right track. What are you doing here? Are you want, do you want that line or not? No brakes, no brakes. You up there, that tree is. Yeah, yeah. That. What a gun. What a gun. Oh, you were right? going up the tree, man. Right. Oh, sorry. Christ. Got a sticker there, mate. Car got up there relatively easy enough. What's he? Didn't try and drive up a tree. That, the chassis extension, though, is an, at an advantage because you're not you're not getting stuck in everyone else's wheel ruts. He's you like, your own. <laughs> yeah, he's just like driving over the top of them. Also, I just want to make note of how good having LED spotties is. How good is that? Stock Pajero high beams, LED spotties. Okay, back at camp and finally onto the lemon squashes for the day. Got a bit of a setup going. Got the rooftop set up. Now we're cooking up some dinner. I've got the fridge full of food. Strawberries, sausos, bit of camembert. Um, some bacon and eggs for the morning. What's going on over here? What are we, what are we, what's this? What cooking something oh. in a Weber, the worst idea ever. Come on, mate. Right. Weber I'm is the best. The Weber. That's all right. Bruh, let's cook for we've kebabs. Some kebabs. We've got some steak. What are you making for dinner, Alan? Corona. What are you guys having for dinner? Mexican lemon. I'm what I think some rissoles and sausages or something. Oh, are you making dinner and made lunch? Should we do one of those like YouTube cook up things? Because that's what four wheel drive YouTubers do. It seems like the thing. Do you want to do one? Better. I've only got steak are and veg though. Are we that advanced at four wheel drive YouTube? Be rude not to. Maybe not. I mean, the Pajero is pretty advanced. What do you reckon? Tell you what, mate, this is the best camp in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Best. It's about as much fun as you can have with your clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> no, but really, do you want to do one or not? What are you, are you cooking? Well, I'm cooking, but watch? well, you got to stand there with me and. <clears throat> I think your job is steal beers. You've, you've well, Woody cooks and you've then banter you about. How about how about we say the cook up for next time, and I can put a carton on my head, chef Spud style, and we have to get we have to get our um, Skid Factory brand steaks on the, on the store first. Oh yeah. <laughs> 300 gram rum, skid factory special. <laughs> a brand, like a proper brand. Yeah. With tears oh, that's on the sick. <laughs> That'd be cool. <laughs> how, much, Dude, how much are you selling them for? Bring out with Jaffle makers. Jaffle makers. How much are uh, 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 Rum. 15 bucks from the from the pub on a oh, yeah. Tuesday, uh, Wednesday night. Yeah, so true that. It'll be worth at least that. Yeah, okay. All right. Postage might be an issue. But. Okay, you had you had it here first. Skid Factory branded steaks. Next time round, we're out here camping. I'm signing off for the night. Fire's roaring over there, ready to go, and we'll chime back in tomorrow morning for some bacon and eggs and more tracks, more Pajero. I'm very impressed with this. I'm absolutely, I'm just, just stoked. So enjoy. Speak to you tomorrow morning. Yeah, that they don't have, but you're all bought the same. Because Woody bought his whole house. Yeah, right.
We <laughs> bought the house. Well, like yeah. we'll... Morning, boys. <laughs> Mill house's dad. That it's like, look at this, boys. I live in my own. I live in my house, and it rolls. <laughs> <laughs> this is just fruit picking 101. This, this setup. Going around Oswoody. No, no, no thanks. What's for breakfast over five, here? Five, five, five. Mate, we got What's bacon. What's for breakfast over here? We got some cheap snossies, some more exy snossies. We got some cheese. We got some wraps going. Breaky wraps, spinach. I don't, I don't think I've ever been heard it called a snossy with an N. Snossy. Snorker. Snorker. Snorkers, yeah. Mm. There you go. How about some of those eggs? Yeah, yeah, the eggs is a bit of a discrepancy, man. Don't really have a pan. Yeah, you just clean that, put it on the heat, and that'll clean right up. That's flavour there, mate. Yeah, right. Can I see that? On top of the sausage. Just. I thought we were packing up and going home. I mean, going on the road. Classic stitch up. What have you done here? I think I rolled my keys up in the swag. It was so neat, too. What's the plan, Rodrigos? Morning, Alan. Well, Sam's hopefully fixed his car. He's heading home now. Hopefully. We, hopefully, we are going to hit the tracks again. Pack up the car. Go and do... You, you packed down the big dog on the roof already. Took me all of 30 seconds, mate. Easy. Oh, yeah. Did, you, gonna... did you pack your keys in it? No, I didn't. <laughs> See how far I make it. Vic, we'll success. see you up the road. Uh, it is for now, but you know what happened last time? It lasted five minutes. Sweet, bro. Thanks, boys. Shame I couldn't get more driving footage or anything, but these guys had a killer time. So, that thing goes hard. Thanks, mate. Thanks for coming. I have man. a new respect for Pajeros. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I know, right? <laughs> Worst. Oh. All right, drive safe, dude. Yeah, Cheers, man. man. See you, dude. See you soon, man. Oh, have a good weekend. Might see you later, but hopefully not. Yeah. What's up, bro? Well, rally, club rally. Well, if we do that, then we, we'll end up here and then we can go up here a lot more. Second, chirped. All right, club rally circuit turned in to be a flop. So now we're heading into God knows what this is called.
only thing I can say that isn't you know, quite right with this is I think I need another transmission cooler. The, the transmission temperature does get fair up there when you, especially doing this slow stuff where there's a lot of converter slip, putting heat into the into the fluid. So I might address that. Otherwise, it's ridiculously easy to do just anything that we've done so far because the thing has just got so much torque, it's ludicrous. And, you know, diff locks and that sort of stuff, decent tyres, it's just awesome. Can entertain. Most fun you can have with your pants on. <laughs> pants on, sorry. <laughs> coming out of the bead that's the problem when you're going through those gnarly things. Okay, new Hilux hill this is called. Kai just attempted the big step up and didn't make it. I've made it two meters and got stuck. I'm not gonna try that step up because it looks way too gnarly for me. I'm just gonna roll it. There's some thick boulders here, so. Thank <laughs> you. 
booze bag plates. Wait. Anybody order a limo? Limousine? Limousine? Take me to the strippers, please, sir. <laughs> Oh, this is like on the GoPro, man. This is pretty skids. Jero is king. Coming down a hill is more scarier than going up this because you're slipping around everywhere. Feels so sketchy.
people you come across on the tracks at Land Cruiser Park. How are you, Phil? Boys, how are you? Good, mate. <coughs> nice. Still in one piece, that's what we like to see. <laughs> cool, cool to see it in person, actually. <coughs> and not on its side yet, either. Well, yeah, good on you, by yourself. <laughs> so he invited Phil out, and then obviously there's no reception out here, and he's been driving around all morning looking for us. Just as, for just, as, yeah. just as we're about to leave and go home. <laughs> How much powder does this thing make again? Uh, 432 yeah, at nice. the pubs on 14 pound. Good one. Why no water cool, bro? Come on. Hurt my feelings. Why you need water? Because you'll... Fish have sex in that. <laughs> Have you got lockers? That's our weekend at Pajero Mountain Park, done and dusted. Uh, well, it's not really a weekend because it's actually a Friday. It's, and a, it's our weekend, let's just say that. I've got to head home now and edit up the video for you guys to see on Wednesday. So. Or Monday if you're a Patreon. Or if you're a Patreon, hell yeah. Uh, huge thanks to Dylan and Jackson for coming out and filming for us, helping out. Jackson's mad spotting skills uh, and also just having a couple of lemon squashes at the campfire. Really cool time, and I'm stoked with how the Pajero's gone. It's goes to show you don't need a eighty thousand dollar pa patrol to have fun. So I think it's everyone is absolutely shocked about how good that thing is off road. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Stoked, <laughs> the bash Some of plates, us believe the bash plates have been absolutely demolished. There's there's ding, but if I didn't have them there, I'd yeah, you would have been in trouble. I would have been going home with a bent fuel tank. So. Thanks for watching. I know it's going to be a long episode because there was like three cameras and I've got hours and hours of footage. So thanks for hanging around till the end. And stay tuned for next week where we're back on some street cars because apparently people don't like four-wheel drives. Unless they do, but I which they them. do. And I'm, I'm going to be back with the Pajero. I've still got some more plans. Snorkel, airbox, lockers. I don't know. And then Big Red at Glass House. I think I'm done with the patrol. It actually works amazingly well. It's just ridiculously Kai, capable. Kai, you should buy the patrol. Yeah. <laughs> and the turbo didn't blow it, so. Not this time. Third time. Alan like wins biggest ledge. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. What, hit, what was that? Old Hilux Hill. Yeah. 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 That was gnarly. This is a crazy park out here. Awesome to come out and camp too. So if you're in the area, definitely give it a try one day. Just watch out for the dude in the old ute, he gets very cranky for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, thanks for watching dudes. See you next week. And uh, yeah, check out the merch store for all that cool stuff. Back on to Bedford and some crazy old 70s JDM icon the following week, maybe. Sounds good. Stay tuned. Sweet as. See you dudes. <laughs>